Unlike civilians, the Israeli military won't get a day off for the country's general election on Tuesday. So instead, soldiers were allowed to vote two days early at a naval base in the town of Ashdod. Around 60 polling stations have been open over the weekend just for the army. Polls suggest the right-wing and religious Likud Beitenu bloc are likely to win a slim parliamentary majority, 63 out of 120 available seats. That puts Benjamin Netanyahu on course to secure a third term in office as prime minister. That's despite support for the government waning when corruption charges were levelled at his former foreign minister. Avigdor Lieberman was forced to step down last month. Another ex-foreign minister, Tzipi Livni, who formed the centrist Hatnoa party last year, has called for a unity government in light of what she described as the emergency situation facing Israel.